Any questions for uh, Coach Eves, Dennis? That got kind of uh, hairy down at the down the stretch there. Uh, it seemed like you had chances to make it easier than it turned out to be. Yeah, there's uh, the, the lesson tonight falls in the category of uh, a young team learning how to win um, when things aren't going in the net. I mean, with the chances after two periods will be lopsided, and uh, it's a two-one game. And I, we got outside the box of things that we were doing well, Dennis. And as a result, we ended up looking scrambly. And we started doing things that are not us in, in terms of our identity. And as a result, uh, you know, we gave up 16 shots. And Maddie had to come up with some big saves for us. So it's, it's a maturity lesson for us. And, uh, and one that we haven't been in this, this position very much this year. Uh, it's one that uh, you have to put into your hip pocket, and hopefully we have that opportunity to, to be in this position again and do a better job in terms of closing it up. Is there a blessing in disguise that your young goalie under duress with a game on the line had to yep. come through time and time and time again? Yep, no, that's uh, definitely, I think that for him is a real confidence booster, the fact that uh, we had to lean on him as their goalie uh, was leaned on in, in the first two periods, and as a result, he preserved the win for us. That last play when uh, they get behind yep. you, how's your heart beating, and uh, what, what's your... Well, that's a young defenseman uh, puck watching and not having that good peripheral vision, and the young man kind of looped in behind, and uh, we lost him, and uh, Matty had to come up with a good save. Uh, that's, that's a lesson for a young man, and, you know, the nice thing about it didn't cost us tonight, and so we can we can learn in a lot more positive way. <laughs> just hold on. Just put your name on that tonight. Yeah. yeah. All things considered, you, you got two wins out of the weekend, which I think was probably your bottom line, wasn't it? Yeah. I mean, we wanted to be one and zero last night. We're one and zero tonight, and uh, we did an awful lot of good things. I think the majority of things we did, we'll be very pleased at. Uh, I know today when we looked at video, there was a lot of things to build on. Uh, we were probably, th through 60 minutes, we were a better team last night than we were tonight, especially the last 20. But um, these are lessons that become valuable as you move down the seasons. And uh, I think that we're astute enough as a coaching staff that we'll, we'll go back to these things, we'll look at them, what could we have done different so the next time we're in this situation we'll be more effective. You're controlling you're getting all the shots and yet they score and it's 1-1 and it didn't take three minutes Seamus yep. put you back in front how big was it to get back ahead quickly before it really built? It, it was big and I think the, the what was really interesting Dennis is even before the goal was how was the next shift after they scored and we had good energy we drew the penalty we were on the power play and that that one group did everything but put it in and actually I don't know how long the uh, power or penalty had been up, but we scored relatively soon, and it was most of the power play guys are out there. So it was the shift after the goal, their goal that was really important, and as a result, we drew a penalty, and then we ended up scoring. So uh, big, big, big pushback for us. Those are one of those pivotal times of the game. Thanks, Coach. Thank you.